Whether you believe this as fact, whether you believe this as fiction, aka stories, then why would the Smithsonian Museum hide these things? Why would the top official governments hide these things? I'm talking about angels that fell from heaven, lost their first estate, the beauty of their estate, for the rebellion. Now, these angels, and we're not talking Satan and uh, those angels, we're talking about many other angels, decided to go to Mount Hermon, as we know the story. And on Mount Hermon, they made a pact to, to try to destroy man. So what did they do? They transformed themselves into either angels of light, or they transformed themselves into beautiful men, or they transformed themselves into the spouses of the ladies. Now, they came into the daughters of men, which in other words mean they, they, they intermingled, they, you know, they made love to the earth women. These earth women bore children, and these children were hybrid between angels and, de uh, and, and human beings. Skip forward a little bit. These demons are not even the demons, but these 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 Nephilim were walking around the planet, and you know man couldn't sustain them anymore, so they decided to start eating man. You know, God had sent a flood and killed everything. Now, the thing is, I don't think a lot of people understand why. God did what he did and why the Nephilim cannot go to heaven. God did it because the angels were not supposed to have sex with the earth women and they did. The reason why the Nephilim, the spirits, the demons are on this planet and can't go anywhere is because they are not a creation of God. So these these demonic forces are waiting judgment and their judgments right now well their torments right now are, are if they enjoyed sex or food or drinking of blood or you know what I mean anything like that because you've heard stories about women having sex with ghostly things right demons demons are unclean spirits Furthermore, God wasn't genocidal. God isn't this, you know, angry God. God had a purpose for what he did. The women, possibly men, Nephilim, and children, Nephilim, were killed because they were not a creation of God. Lucifer, Satan, was supposed to bow down to man. And Satan want to do that. That's where it all kind of started. Feel me? So, skipping forward to where I was, the hold on, guys. I gotta always I gotta tap my screen every so often so it doesn't time out on me. But anyway, now my production value for my videos are not very large, as you guys can tell. But I get the I get what I have to say off my mind. If you look at gravestones and things like that, there's a channel out there. Um, forgotten the channel's name. If I remember it, I'll put a link in the description down. Oh, it's called uh, I Am Created. This person does work on the so-called statues that we see that are not really statues. If you guys want to go over there, you can. I've been over there a couple times. Not too bad. Pretty good stuff. Um, they, the person goes through a lot of different things that you may not have seen. Uh, but that's on you. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. If you don't, you don't. You can go always have. A, you can always go have a check. But anyway, if you watch some movies where demons take hold of people. These demons have been without bodies for a long time. That's why they act all weird and all jittery. 
because they're not supposed to be in there in the first place. Some people invite them in because they can only go in while they're invited. They can't just burst in. Doesn't it doesn't work like that? And I think that people need to understand that these things were extremely evil. Okay. And there's really not much more to say about them. You guys should know it. If if you guys don't believe in it, that's fine. If you guys believe in it, that's great. I I'll leave a I'll leave a hundred percent on one side and a hundred percent on the other. Me, I believe it happened because the Bible states that we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against dark principalities of this world that we can't see. And we're not talking fallen angels. We're talking demonic, demonic demon. Demons. Demons are the dead Nephilim, like I've mentioned. This is educational as far as I can go with it. This is as educational as I get. Um, there are a lot of other people out there to cover the same stuff, but better than I do, like Rob Skiba, perhaps, or... Oh, I don't know. There's only a couple out there, and sometimes I, I watch channels, and then I go to watch them again, and they've disappeared because I've watched so much of this stuff. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Just remember, when people say fallen angels are demons, they are not. These The fallen angels are actually held in chains underneath the earth. I believe they say Azazel is chained and is put under sharp rocks until the day of judgment none of these fallen angels have been judged yet they are still waiting <clears throat> for judgment satan has not fallen from where his heaven is where god cast him but satan is the prince of the air and i've covered that before so guys much love comment like and or subscribe